Previously, Jackson got Heath and Holt to give him a makeover after Abby bullied him online. But unfortunately, Heath takes the makeover too far and turns Jackson into someone unrecognizable. Oh my god! Kylie Jenner just posted the cutest picture of Stormy on Instagram! Wow, I hadn't seen it yet. I'll have to go drop it a like and maybe a comment. Anyway, like, how many new Instagram followers have you gotten yet today? Um, like 250. Oh, and Sugar Bear Hair reached out to me to do a sponsorship. Hmm, not too bad. Those Sugar Bear Hair vitamins aren't nearly as prestigious as Fit Peas are, but you'll get there. I've worked years for my status as Fit Pea ambassador and Instagram influencer. Don't feel bad. Hey, Jackie, are you ready for lunch? Oh, um, actually, I'm eating lunch with Heath today. Oh, right, you guys are friends now. Well, mind if I join you two? Actually, only aspiring Instagram influencers can eat lunch here. Sorry. What? Jackie, we always eat lunch together. It's tradition. You can't sit with <laughs> us! Oh, okay. I guess I'll just leave you two alone then. Ugh. So... How many Instagram followers have you gotten now? Hey Frankie, what's wrong? Uh, Jackson just totally ditched me. Apparently he only eats lunch with Heath now. Ugh, that sucks. Jackson's like a whole different person after Heath gave him that makeover. For real. I liked Jackson way better when he was a loser that I could make fun of on my blog. That's the way things are supposed to be. I've just never seen Jackson act this way before, especially towards me. Hey, don't worry, we'll get him back to normal. Whatever Heath did to him can't be permanent, right? Well, I guess our plan of attack will have to wait until after class. Um, Jackson, you're in my seat. Actually, Raven, Jackson sits next to me now. Okay, well, you two can sit together somewhere else, but this is my seat. I've sat here all year long. Good morning, class. Welcome in. Raven, if you could take a seat, please. Ugh. All right, everyone. Oh, before we get started, Jackson, if you could take off your hat, please. Remember our rule. If we're in school, hats aren't cool. Actually, I'm going to keep my hat on. It's kind of a fashion statement. Sorry, Jackson, but you know the Monster High dress code doesn't allow hats in the classroom. And I care why? I'm not taking it off. Well, Jackson, if you won't listen to the rules, I'm afraid I'll have to send you to the principal's office. Whatever. Oh my ghoul, Jackson's never been sent to the principal's office before. Hello, Jackson. I was surprised when I was told you failed to comply with the school's dress code. I noticed you haven't had any behavioral problems before. Yeah, well that's about to change. I'm not a goody-two-shoes loser anymore. Well, I certainly hope that isn't true. Anyway, I'm gonna let you off with a detention since this is your first offense, but if you keep up this bad behavior, you can expect a suspension. Pfft, whatever. Alright, this is getting out of control. Agreed. Like, totally out of control. 
Oh, don't even start complaining, Holt! You are partially responsible for this, you know! Um, no I'm not. All I did was help Jackson look a little more swaggy. It was Heath who brainwashed him or whatever. Besides, the whole reason he wanted a makeover was because of your hate blog! It doesn't matter whose fault it is! All that matters is that we have to get Jackson back to his old self! And how are we supposed to do that? Jackson's lost it. Frankie, I think you're the only one who can convince him to change. Maybe if you tried breaking up with Jackson, he'd see that his makeover only made him worse. That seems like a pretty good idea. I'll go try it. Oh, I hope this works. Me too. The last thing we need is a clone of Heath running around. Jackson, we need to talk. Fine. What? Well, I really don't like who you've turned into lately. If you want to act like this forever, then I think we need to break up. What? You're breaking up with me? Dude, it doesn't even matter! You're like totes popular now! You can get so many other chicks! OMG, dude, you're so right. Okay, Frankie, whatever then, I guess. Wait, so you're really just gonna let me in things like this? Yeah, I guess so. Wha- I, I can't believe this! So, how many Instagram followers do you have now? Hmm, a little over 5,000, I think. Awesome! Yeah. <laughs> Guys, it didn't work! Jackson just let me break up with him! And after everything, I'm done for him! <laughs> Aw, Frankie, I'm so sorry. I really thought that would work. Ugh, so what now? Does anybody have a plan B? Nope, but we need to think of one quick. Girls' bathroom, now! No, no, guys, it's fine. I'll just stay here and watch, I guess. Ugh, left out again. Okay, guys, think. What could we do to get Jackson back to normal? I have no idea. Whatever Heath did to him really messed him up. We've gotta figure something out. The Jackson I know is nothing like the new Jackson. Somebody call 911! There's an emergency! Ugh, Heath, what are you doing in the girls' bathroom? Does that matter? We have a situation. It's Jackson. He's out of control. Oh, whatever, Heath. I have no sympathy for you. Whatever is wrong with Jackson is all your fault. Are you kidding me, Abby? I never meant for this to happen. He's become too powerful. Ugh, what does that even mean? You should have known that trying to turn anyone into you was a bad idea, you fool. Ugh, let me explain. Jackson just got more Instagram followers than me, which officially means he's more powerful than me. I have to stop him so I can rightfully restore myself as the most popular Instagrammer in school. Seriously, Heath? Of all the reasons to hate Jackson, his follower count is what finally does it for you? Hey, this is serious. I can't have Jackson calling the shots and stealing my sponsorships. Like we're supposed to care about your stupid Instagram career, Heath. Jackson turned into the spawn of Satan all because of you. Oh, please! Don't act like you're so innocent, Abby! Jackson only wanted to be cool so you would stop bullying him. I'm the one who helped him, so technically I'm the good guy here. Guys, stop fighting so we can just save Jackie! Heath, you've got to know how to get him back to normal, right? Yeah, Heath. If you want to help us fix Jackson, you're going to have to tell us what you did to him in the first place. All I did was put him through some intense training and a little bit of brainwashing through an electric shock machine. Hey, maybe electrically shocking him again would reverse his new personality. Wait, what? You electrically shocked my baby? Chill out, it's not a big deal. A little bit of electricity isn't gonna kill anyone. Besides, the guy who sold me the machine on the black market told me it was totally safe, at least 20% of the time. Come on, I'll show you guys. See? Here's the machine. Totally harmless. Oh, wow. You weren't lying. Um, how long has this been in our kitchen? Okay, great. But if we're seriously gonna try to reverse Jackson's makeover with this thing, how are we supposed to convince him to get in there? I'm pretty sure he likes being cool now. Besides, this thing looks like a freaking torture chamber. Uh, you seriously don't think I've already thought of that? I went ahead and whipped up a special drink for our pal Jackson. It's just got a little secret ingredient, horse tranquilizer. Hey Jackson, I made you a kale smoothie chock full of protein. Oh, sounds good. I'm in need of some nutritious refreshment. Oh no. Ugh, what was that? Huh? Where am I? Guys? No! Let me out! Let me out! Fasten your seatbelt! You're in for a wild ride! 
Oh, I hope this works. Ah! No! Let me out! Let me out! Oh. J J Jackson? Huh? Frankie? What's going on? Oh, God! Ow! Oh my gosh! Jackie! You're back! Well, since it looks like we're done here, I've gotta go. I have a very interesting blog post to write. Ha ha ha.